this was actually August Bank Holiday Monday. And you can see we had beautiful weather and a nice calm sea. And we're just heading off round Ballard down. Um, and you can see it's quite a spectacular bit of coastline. And there's Swanage in the distance. And we just go around and then we go past Delston Head and we're heading off towards Portland Bill, south of Portland Bill, to dive a very large wreck. And this area of coastline is very popular with rock climbers. engines and you can see some large bits of pipe work though Andy there's found a sole of a shoe I don't know whether it's uh, from the original wreckage or just something that's almost dropped and you can see here this looks like one of the crankshafts from the engine or con rods and uh, this really looks shows you the scale of the engines in these Liberty ships they were absolutely massive and they were built on a massive scale in America during the Second World War and this is Andy pointing out one of the masts. I guess this is towards the stern of the wreck, and uh, it really is a substantial piece of metal. So uh, you can see it's got a ladder going up inside it. It must be four foot diameter, and you can just see. There's like an exit hole where people would have been able to climb up inside and come out, but the mast just goes on and on. Now we swim across some large sections of hull, and uh, I swim down across to the seabed. Where and I see this as a bomb, and um, I can see in a second that it is actually an aeroplane bomb because it's got the the fins right next to it which would have um, guided it down head first but I think this is one of the cargo, there are several of these lying around the wreck although I've only put one on the film and this would have been the cargo of the ship and then just swim back towards the boilers which are massive and it's time to get my bag out and uh, get off and on the ascent and on the ascent you can see that one of the other divers DK bags almost catches me and it is actually travelling quite fast although it looks slow because of my head following the bag but if it had have caught me it would have sure to have carried me to the surface.